Are we on? Yes. Hello body coach people. How are you? Sunday morning and do you know what? It is not even 7am. Imagine that and I live half an hour away from here. But uh, just glorious up a place called Nickinock. Just amazing views. It's just, you know, alright, you know. So all I was wanting to say, I've not done a workout this weekend, not an official Joe one, because I did Monday to Friday. I did all five cycle three workouts and I'm just loving them. So I'm going to start again on Monday. And that's how I'm going to do it Monday to Friday and then Saturday, Sunday. But I did a seven mile Nordic yesterday. I love Nordic walking with my poles. Fabulous it is. Great upper body workout. And we're doing about six miles this morning. Um, and yeah, it's early, but I was tired this morning and I'd planned to get up at half five and the alarm went off. I'm just following on from what I said yesterday. And I thought, oh, should I stay in? But do you know what? I ask, I tell myself something and it's a top tip. You've got a choice, a choice that you make right then. But it's a choice like you make, do you do the workout? It's a choice like, do you have the ice cream? A choice like, do you stick to the plan? They're all choices that only you can make. And you've got to be happy with your choices. And really, there's no right or wrong, I don't think. It's what you're going to be happy with and what how quickly you want your results. So my choice this morning, the first choice of the day is always do a get up or do a press that snooze button and go back to sleep or do a not even set it in the first place. Do I make the choice last night? Now look what, look what I've experienced. I mean, it's a bit hazy now, but it was beautiful before and it still is. It's not even seven o'clock and we're halfway around this walk. Honestly, the cows we've seen, the lambs, dog chasing the birds, just love it. Now, I had a choice. I could have rolled over and gone back to sleep, but do you know what I say to myself? I'd still be tired when I woke up at nine. I'd still want to get out of bed. And all that time, that two and a half hours, I would never, ever remember the back of my eyelids, ever. That's not a memory that I can take with me. That's not a memory that can feed me and make me feel like I want to do the best for myself. So honestly, if you're in doubt, five, four, three, two, one, get up and get your workout done. Whether it's one of your hit sessions, whether it's coming out and being active, because you don't remember the back of your eyelids. I tell you, it's, it's just common sense, look like that. <laughs> hey, now I'm gonna, my back's a bit dodgy today sometimes the high knees oh we've got some runners coming i'm going to attempt to get up here i've done it before <laughs> but when you're approaching 50 with a knackered back it's not done in a game so i've got the ladder if you need it <laughs> right then <laughs> you've just got to stay with it and keep being active <laughs> so graceful <laughs> oh my god do you know what my plan is Come closer, Si. I don't think I want to. My plan is to live to 100. And do you know what? To do that, you need to stay active. It's never too late to start. So get your hits done. Get eating well. And have the odd ice cream. Because life's too short not to have ice cream. Here. Now, if I'd have stayed in bed, look at this. It just feels amazing. I wouldn't have it. But I'm doing all the workouts. I'm making the recipes and I'm loving it. And I'm eating, I've eaten a bit much ice cream this week, but I'll rein it in next week. Got a couple of runners. So five, four, three, two, one. Get out of bed, get your workout done and have a great day. All right. I know I'll be getting on your tits, but I'm really sorry. Have a lovely day. How am I going to get down, Si? You're not. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow because I'm going back to workout one, cycle three. I tell you, feeling great. Ta-ra, bye.